All right, guys. Well, looks like we were found out here. These guys, I think, were wanderers, but... A bunch of them came by. I was loading stuff into the bike, and they just showed up. And I'm empty. Come on, buddy. You can do the ladder. Well, could have been worse. So, let's just, we're running out of ammo fast. Let's leave our Molotovs there for now. Put the wrench up. So, we're going to read the map. We fell short of being able to get enough coin. I think we made about, with these, selling these mechanical and electrical parts, you know, we made about 1,800. So, we're just short. Um, by a few hundred so we'll see what happens when we get there now we do have shotgun parts that we can sell Let's put the fuel there I managed to get enough fuel to refuel the mini bike which is good but I stripped like everything in here with the exception of this light looks like let's grab that real quick so we've been getting brass off these lights so I've been stripping the lights as well so this morning uh, we're gonna go get on the bike and we're gonna have a look around we don't have very many slots left to grab the books out of here like I grabbed all the secret loot that was like everywhere the stuff up on here everything so we're gonna go out I knocked all the stone out to get stone and, and uh, sand um, that's all on the bike now too so we'll probably read this map if we can't get enough stuff to uh, sell to the trader. I don't want to sell the, the 44 schematic. It's only it's only there in my inventory in case we can't get enough. All right, well, maybe we take it. You know what? Maybe that's what we do is we wrench a couple of cars and hope we find an engine or something that we can sell. I've got a couple of level six batteries, but I don't want to sell those unless I have to. Listen for runners. Nope. Let's grab this car. So it's the morning now. We did okay in the evening. Been trying to hang on to like uh, plastic polymers. Now, we, like I said, we have two lead car batteries. They're worth a thousand each. I mean, we could just sell those and hope we get some later on. But level sixes are hard to get. I'm shocked that we picked up two of them. So, all right, what do we got here? No eggs. All right, we're gonna go over here. Looks like this is like a mail office or something. Yeah, there's a couple of safes in here. That I know. There's also zombies too, so. We're gonna go in with the hand cannon, save our ammo for when we're in a pinch here. All right, well, let's wake them up. Well, they're not waking up. I don't see any either. Wouldn't that be cutting a nice break? Nothing there. Bet you they're behind here. Nothing. Really? Is this place empty? It's freaking empty. Well, hey, I'm not going to argue. Probably gonna ditch those. Okay, what do we got? Night Stalker. Never encumbered at night. Not that it matters. 125. Let's hang up. Well, you know what? We gotta complete the book sets anyways. Let's just use that. Scrap these. Alright, let's just hack into these saves here. Okay, what do we got in this guy? Ooh, okay, well. That can go on something. Scrap that for the parts. Take this. We're not going to have room for anything. Let's break into this one. Now, I, know, I think there's two more small safes out behind us. I know there's one kind of in the back door. And then I think there's one up on the wall behind the counter back there. Let's check out what's in here. Okay, this has got 15 rounds. We'll take those. 
This is all empty. Let's just wrench uh, this apart. A few parts for that. Now we got a, there's got a wall safe there. Now we do have a few uh, more of these out here. Five parts. Okay, now, what are we dropping here? Scrap polymers. Really? Alright, let's go drop some stuff in the bike. We got room for anything in here. Leather. I just want to scrap those papers. All right, what's in here? Okay, that's nice. All right, we got to ditch stuff now. Let's, let's see what's in here. More ammo. We got to take the rest of that too. That's worth nothing. Take that. Um, okay, well three coins it's almost time for the trader to be open maybe we go hit up her first then come back here and grab some stuff definitely want the oil all right what do we got we can stick in here nothing I don't think polymers ah uh, man we don't really there's so much stuff we could I can just throw away I guess all right let's repair this get some good coin for that now we do have, yeah, we do have a wood splitter already. We don't need that. Let's go back in here. All right, let's deposit. This is worth what, 12? That's worth 20. That's worth 20. I don't know. Let's just do that for now. And let's break into now what do we have in here? Did we take everything? Oh, we didn't take everything out of here. Eight times schematic and a nail gun schematic. I think that should probably put us over the top. 200, 400 if we sell those. This came back at 430. Yeah, I think we got enough now. All right, we're going to come back and get these. Actually, let's just break into them. We do have a few minutes before she opens. So we'll break into this safe and the one in the back door there. Okay, we'll have a look in these two before we go. So that's so we're 63. We can repair that. We'll get some coin for that. And then in here, we have, we definitely want to take the money now. Let's uh, ditch that. Grab that. You gotta wander. Okay, I'm gonna use this. Actually, what if we repair that? Now, where do we put the cash? No, out here, I think. There we go. A little bit of extra cash. What do we have? Something, something scrapping? No? Did we leave anything behind? I don't think we did that we want to keep. Let's keep the water. Oh, we were repairing the uh, sludge. There it is. That was the end of our, our repair kits. That's why. All right, that makes sense. Are you... What are you... You seem very angry. Let's just do this. We can get the hell out of here if we have to. You seem very angry. Like ridiculously angry. Cool off, buddy. Jeez. All right, let's head over to the trader. All right, here we go. Let's go inside, sell what we got, pick up the crucible, and get our asteroid home. We've got the best prices in the wasteland. Okay. Don't know if I want to sell those just yet. We're going to sell that. Well, those guys for sure. 155 for that. That's worth it. Yeah, that and that. 
What are we at? 6,400. We don't even, we're not even close yet. I think I was factoring in the mechanical and electrical parts. Sell those. Sell that. Those three. We're at 7,200. Now we need 76, right? For the crucible? 7,500. Um, let's sell these guys. There's 73. Um, there we go. Oh, yeah. We got four coins to our name, but I don't really care. We have a crucible now. Remember me if you need medical supplies. I will. Don't worry. This is the best place to ever come to. Let's make sure we mark this on the map. Just going to save it as our regular trader waypoint. All right. Got to make sure we put our land claim block down. Now, we, we didn't go actually go through her place here, did we? Let's go ahead and do that now. Ooh, that's nice. Ten forged steel out of the uh, workbench there. And we got some lockpicks, finally. Nice. I think we can go over to the other trader now and see if we can pick his safe behind him. The one just north of us. Now, we picked up a few things. Some oil shale, some sand, cement. We're going to sell this. Got the steel. Got three glue. That's not, not that bad. But we're going to sell those at the other trader when we get there. Now, we did forget to check his stuff out front here, so let's just grab these real quick. One pipe. Oh, some more shrooms and six oil. So that's two mushroom seeds we picked up. And we don't need the paper. All right, let's just put those in the bike before we go inside. Now, gas it up. Getting pretty close to using up all the gas. So we we're at full. Just scrap this. Put the steel in here. Put that in there. These guys can go in there. Uh, yeah, looking pretty good here. I mean, we've picked up a ton of stuff. 16 steel. Good stuff. Let's go in here and sell this stuff off. A little chilly here, too. Okay, we're going to sell that. We'll keep the glue. Safe travels. Now, let's see. Let's see, Bob. Let's see if uh, you're allowing us to get this safe here. There we go. Second try. Oh, not bad. All right, let's sell these off. Sell. That's worth. Fi well, we might as well sell it. We don't. We don't have any coins at all. Let's just sell this AK. Keeping the ammo because we're going to have a uh, a 44 soon enough. And I think that's it. 480, eh? Thanks for shopping here. Thanks for being here. At least you're not a much of a jerk as your brothers are. All right, let's grab one thing out of here. Actually, you know what? Let's not. We don't have to. We're okay. Let's just get out of the snow and rain so we're not freezing. All right, guys. There's a bit of a motor home here. Now, we do have a bit of space in our inventory. It's really close to where the traders were. The traders are just actually over that way. So I think we're going to go through here. And see what we got. We're going to go clear it out. Now, this is the place with all of the uh, air conditioners in the back. I guess we're smashing into everything here. What's up, lady? Hello. Oh, that's not good. Can't start the day off like that. Getting cocky. We may not make it back home. Bleed out. You can get a full barrel, though. Oh, maybe only if I reload on time. He pulled me forward, too. Should have bought that food. Anything in here? Nothing. All right, well, let's hope there's something in here. Gun safe. We got a guy down here, which we can't see his head, unfortunately. Worth it. 
We got two lock picks, but I don't know if I'll use them for that place. Now these, okay. Got some sleepers in here. Headshot. All right, see if we got any food in here. Well, we got some water. Nothing. Lucky Googles. Plus six. What are we wearing? We're wearing, we're wearing Lucky Goggles, right? What are ours? Plus six, still the same. All right, well, we can just scrap this. Gonna ditch the die for now. We don't need that. Uh, let's hang on to the wrench until we need to scrap it. Okay, I'll quiet in here. Scrap that. Let's go ahead and take this off of here. That door open, it's locked. Beautiful thing about it is we get brass for breaking these doors. Nothing, eh? Not gonna wrench the beds apart. We do have springs in the, uh, you know what, maybe I should. Have to hate to have to say this, but I'm thinking we gotta take these beds apart for the springs. Definitely gonna need them to make weapons later on. We need them for grenades. Definitely taking springs. All right, nothing else in here. Not worried about the wood or anything. Okay, what do we have on us? Can scrap this. Can scrap this. And we can scrap the brass. Uh, let's just leave it there for now. We'll scrap it all when we get all of the uh, door handles. Get rid of the rest of our gas if we can. Yep, 38, beautiful. No, 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 that's not all of it. Okay, six springs, put those in there. All right, well. Time to start visiting the guests. Taking all the doorknobs along the way. Uh, hazmat guy decided he was going to stay here. Oh. Dude. Alright, let's just kill everybody first and then we'll loot after and see what we get out of it here. Ooh, you got a jacuzzi. Dude, I want to stay here. room are you in? <laughs> gotta be careful. We gotta be careful. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a bandage. Well. Got a sleeper. I don't know if he's in here. Nope, all quiet in this front. He's in there. Slow poke. Ooh. Dude, you're lying on your head. Big bathrooms. Bigger than the bedrooms. All right, we got somebody down there. Doesn't work, doesn't work, does work. Cool, we can buy some stuff after this. We don't find any food. Come on, buddy. Just gonna walk right through that car, huh? Ooh. 
This axe, man. As long as you got the stamina. Okay, that's all quiet. That's not. Well, I think we broke a lot of people up. And we're going to get so much brass off this place, it's great. Don't steal my brass doorknob. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Go down, go down, go down, go down. Die. Alright. What do we got in here? I think that's a clear. Wow. Totally worth it. Alright, I'm going to clear this place out. And at the end, I will show you what we get out of it. Now I'm going to wrench all of this stuff. Go for the brass. Get as much stuff for weapons as we can get. Um, yeah. Alright, I'll see you in a minute. Alright guys, so we went through this whole place. Didn't get a whole lot of stuff. 18 doorknobs, uh, 16 brass faucets. We found a toilet pistol, some springs, some uh, um, bottles of acid and stuff. A lot of brass. All the light fixtures, uh, which I've wrenched all part except for these two, um, have had a fair amount of brass, like over 20 each when I was wrenching them. Like, well, that was only had 14. One of them had 30. So I guess it's just very, I guess it's random. That one's 27. So, and we've cracked into this safe. I tried using my last two um, lock picks to get in here. Well, there's a trench back here. But I couldn't get in. They broke. So I was able to just smash in. And there's not much in here. All right, we'll take those. Looks like we've got a bit of things to sell. Now, I do want to go drop some stuff in the bike. I think what we're going to do, though, is we're going to motor back to the house. We can't keep doing this. Uh, and it be sustainable. So we're going to motor back to the house. I don't think we need these two either. Let's just drop these. Throw that in there. This stuff down here is all sellable. Now the weighted head I'll probably hang on to. Barbed wire mod. I don't think we can put that on anything other than a club, which we are not using, so I'm not worried about that. Uh, so yeah. Let's go ahead and search these cars. I haven't done that. And the other thing I haven't done is I haven't gone around the back to wrench the air conditioners, which we'll do before we go. Iron shovels, just scrap that. Um, and I also have to wrench two of the three um, vending machines. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna get coming back with lots of springs off this mission. That's good. I'm gonna have lots of gear going forward. I do want to be able to make a ton of. That's 119. We'll keep that. Uh, I do want to make a ton of hand grenades. Um, if we had what happened to us, you know, a few nights ago, happen again, where there's massive concentrations of zombies attacking us in an evening or in a daytime. We want to be ready, and I want to make sure we have grenades for that. So I'm going to go ahead and make some of those. Now let's see what's in here. Some springs, some wood, take those. And then I'm going to wrench these apart first. Now we checked this already, right? Yeah, so we're going to wrench these apart and then go around back and wrench the uh, air conditioners. All right, so we wrenched eight of them apart and got four brass radiators, which is pretty good. Pretty good overall. Let's go ahead and scrap these. can always make more in our own forge. And let's get out of here. Well, it looks like I found another one of those military bases. The one thing we are going to have to do, though, on the other base is go back and hit up all those uh, hardened uh, military crates. But there's another one right here. Let's just mark this on the map so we know where it is. I'm going to save it as um, that, probably. We'll come back here at some point. 
Not right away, though. We got other stuff we got to do first. All right, here we are. We're back at home. So first things first, I'm going to unload, get everything upstairs. And then I think what we need to do, since we have our radio now, we'll be able to get the radio tower up and running because we got power. Uh, I'll check to make sure we have engines to get this thing running. Now, I did hit up a couple of gas stations on the way back. So we picked up a little bit more fuel. Not a lot, but a little bit. Enough to get the, uh, the generator up and running. So we're going to dump all this stuff in the house. Um, and then uh, once we do that, we're going to have to finish clearing out this uh, airport. We have a few more places we have to go to clear this place out. Got to take care of that because if we do get in, in touch with command tonight uh, and they do decide to send people in, then um, we want to make sure the airfield is clear. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Okay, we got everything put away. Um, going to go ahead and read this map right now just to see where this treasure is. Let's have a look. Okay, it's way over there. Actually, not that far. 1.6 kilometers. We should be able to do that tomorrow. That's in the east. Now, we do know the zombies were headed that way, so we do need to do some more recon over there. Now, we did a fair bit of journeying today which is really nice. Uh, but we will have to go visit the trader, I guess, tomorrow. I'll give them the bad news that the other uh, two traders over there are wiped out. Um, high attrition. Now, that's three places we found that the uh, White River settlements have been completely overrun with zombies. Not sure when that happened. We'll have to find out when his last contact with them was. All right, let's get in here. Now, did we go in this back room the other day? I think we did. I think we did. Yeah, we cleared out in here. Okay, so let's go. Now, did we clean out all this main floor? I don't think we did. Let's do that before we go upstairs. I know we went fair distance down here. We didn't get everybody. We went a fair distance down here. Yeah, we searched most of this trash already. And we wrenched apart the ones here that we need, we could. I'm going to go ahead... Um, yeah, you know what? Let's hold off. We barely have any coin left. I want to hang on to it. Oh, okay. Well, tell you what. Picked up a couple of pipe bombs today. Let's wake these two fuckers up. Alright, there's a lot more than two. Alright, that's her done. Let's just back up. We're going to drop the junk turret down. Let's get some shotgun in here. See who breaks through here. Oh, he's done. Yeah, I think we woke, woke some up in the back room too. Oh, we didn't check that garbage. Nothing. Gonna put this right here. Now, I know we did up here. At least I think we did this side. Did we? Yeah, that's the bookshelves. No. We haven't done up here yet. This place is huge. Way bigger than I thought. I always feel weird about crossing in front of the junk turret. Now I know it can't hit you, but still, I always feel like it can. Oh crap. Wow, junk took her, turret took her head off. They're all coming out of the washroom, I think. At least that's what it looks like. Oh, it's coming from upstairs. This guy's shaky. There we go. Alright, I guess we gotta clear these guys out upstairs.
She's sleeping. Now that looks like it's bulletproof glass, so... Come on, lady. Oh, we got more down here. Fighting on the stairs is not an easy thing. Ow. Stay down. That was nice. Looks like she's uh, waiting for customers. Can I place my order? She doesn't want to take my order. What about you? I shot her arm off, damn it. All right, we got another guy back here. I think we should be able to handle him with this though. So I come up by opening the cash register. 106, that's nice. Yeah, a little out of range. He's sensible, he's gonna go around. And this one's a runner over here. Well, she would have been a runner. She could have been a contender. Now she's just dead. This place is so big. Once again, shout out to whoever created this. This is just fantastic. Okay, it's going to go through all these real quick here. I want to see if I can grab any medical supplies. Oh, a beaker. Not that we need it. I mean, we got one at home still, but... All right, let's use a bandage. I'm going to eat these peas. Not much, but we'll eat them. We'll eat them. Thank you. They're both walkers. Okay, good. I didn't know that broke out, broke out. That could have been terrible. There were so many zombies down there. Could you imagine that breaking out and falling into all those zombies? Kind of got lucky there. All right. Anybody in here? No. Two more. All right, we're getting real lucky with these shots. Okay, let's gather up all the medical supplies. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna get through this today. This is like really big. Now I wish we could take these and take them home. Those are kind of cool. But you can't. They should have made everything buildable in this game. BDU bottoms. Better than what we got on. Let's take these two and then put them on this. And you. There we go. It's a little better. And let's just see if we can... Ah, forget it. We're going to break into this. Once we get um, more lockpicks, I'll start using on that. Oh, level five. Level five, eight and seven. And this one is like eight and eight with, with two mods on it. Let's do a quick switch around here. I think we can probably fit the, uh, I think we can put the weighted head on that too, if I'm not mistaken. All right, let's loot these really quick. Another beaker. Man, I remember those days when the beakers were so impossible to find. My first series, I think I mentioned this several times, my first series I wasn't able to find a beaker until after day 30. Okay. 
Just gonna loot it all for now. I left the mini bike at home. I should have put it outside. Just so we could put stuff in it, but whatever. Another beaker. That's crazy. Alright, this has all been searched. So we've done this one. Um, let's go back down. Now that we don't have... Okay. Now that we don't have to worry about... Attack from above. We got a ton of guys down here. How do we want to wake them up? Not that way. This way. Hold on to that, will you? <laughs> so worth it. Oh, someone's angry. Winged her. But still got her. That's a playground, eh? Alright, let's go back. Actually, we don't have much time. Let's just do this. Oops. Got more in the washer, I think. Nope. Right here. Now, I think we've cleared the washrooms. I think when we blew stuff up outside, they all came out of here. Yeah, they broke through these doors. Okay, those are clear. We have to do a separate day for looting, I think. Now, this should just be a play area and nothing else. Beautiful. So let's go upstairs. We're going to travel across and end up on the other side. Vending machines. I'm not going to buy anything. We're okay. Hopefully we can find some food. Now somebody mentioned about wrenching these apart. I do know we can wrench them apart. You get um, iron. You get... Um, let's just take that. And we can scrap this. You'll get iron. You'll get mechanical parts. And you'll get a little bit of leather. You get more leather if you just scrap it. And you don't get anything else. Ooh, that's nice. Scrap this. Um, anything else? So yeah, if you've got lots of time, definitely go ahead and pick them up and then take them home and wrench them at night. Definitely worth it. Wow, this place is so big. Now I think we've cleared out most of the Zeds on this side when we were down below. Nav is there. Nice. Nice touch. Okay, I just saw somebody drop over here. Looks like it's just one. Nope. It's a whole bunch of them. That should get those two guys, I think. Well, at least it'll help them come out. That guy's done. Shoot him. Shoot him. Anytime you want to shoot him. I guess he's undetectable. He's the stealth zombie. Alright, looks like we got one guy back here breaking my brass doorknob. That's it for him. I know it's unlocked, but I get the free brass doorknob, so why not? Alright, we got another uh, safe here. Let's just break into this one as well. Like I said, I want to save those lock picks for uh, the gun safes because they they take twice as long to break into. 
either that or you know what we're going to save them for the uh the lock boxes over the big uh military lock boxes that we weren't able to get and not tonight but probably the night after we're going to sneak over there and see if we can break into them at night so i'll just save up all of the uh, lock picks we get in the next couple of days and then we'll sneak over there at night and see what we can get all right that's nice let's just go ahead and scrap this All right, we got, what, two paper we don't need. can drop that. can go ahead and scrap both of these dies. It will save a bit. Uh, we can scrap that. Well, let's just go ahead and use this. We've got three slots left. That's fine. All right, we got to go in here. Now those were those baggage rooms. I think we cleared the people out from here because when we were down below in the baggage handling handling area, I think they tried to come through here and we shot them from the other side. I think. Don't quote me on it. Well, this should be interesting. Looks like someone was trying to check a skater through the uh, baggage here. I don't know what how much does it cost to check a skater boy through the uh the baggage claim probably a fair bit oh we got a guy right here it's mo we had a guy right there so i think this goes out to where we were before beep 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 This could be an issue if you don't know what you're doing. Like me. At least it slows these guys down. Oh, I thought that was going to be a beautiful shot there, and I blew it. I shot for where he was, not to where not where he was going. Um, what was I going to do? Do we have enough to make a band-aid? If I scrap this... A band-aid, yeah. It's just a simple band-aid. Might as well make two. Most likely going to use them. What time is it? we got an hour left. A couple of minutes to get home and a bunch of time to smoke some zombies. Let's scrap this as well. Crap one of those. We'll hang on to that now. I think this is where... Oh! That's the other side. Okay. We're in the second side now. It's all quiet though. Oh, here they come. Not that quiet. Doing a good job. At least those zombies got caught in the bathrooms. They had to break out. How are we doing here? We got no space. Drop that and that. Like I said, we can make coffee at home, so I'm not worried about it. Put you there. Well, let's wake him up. Hey, guys. Come on, over here. Let's go. we got some work to do. Here comes a nurse out of the bathroom. And I think that'll be it for this area. This is a bad idea. Ah, she's still dead. Of 
Christ, a junk church is about as effective as I am. Alright. Wait a minute. This is a whole nother area? Holy crap! Let's wake those two up. Well, we killed one of them. Alright, we gotta smoke these fast. Eh. Loot's loot. Wake up, people. Or former people. Okay, I remember this now. This is where they were trying to break through before. Let's use this. Don't need the beer. Come on out of there. These guys are going to become runners in 10 minutes. Oh shit, that's too many. Oh shit, that's not good. Get this down here where we're going to need it, because that's a lot of zombies. Gonna be nighttime in a second, and that's a lot of zombies. There's nighttime, they're all runners. What am I on? Oh, I'm on barbed wire. Shoot. Like, what the heck was I on? Alright, we got one here. Let's use this. Hey, Martha. Thanks for bringing me my bag up from downstairs. I didn't feel like going down to get it. Ooh, 300 coins. Ooh, some coins. Shotgun's reloaded. Let's not go too crazy. Let's use one more of these. We don't have any. We do have one of these. Okay, let's use that. And you. And you. Let's hope. I think we're clear down here. There's the baggage rooms. That's the elevator. If this room is clean, whether this one's clean or not is a different story. Wait, we went through this already, didn't we? Pretty sure we did. Well didn't necessarily go through it, but certainly everyone's cleared out of there. Washroom should be cleared now. This is cleared, so I think we did a good job. I think, if I'm not mistaken, we should be able to break through here. That's concrete. I love how they did this with concrete. Because it makes it like next to impossible to just like quickly make your way around this place. You gotta spend the time breaking through walls if you want to go anywhere. So you kind of have to follow the snaky path they've laid out for you. Which is kind of nice. Did we go through this back room? I think we did. Let me grab both those. Yeah. And this is metal, I think. The uh, question is, do we have respawns back here? Can I get out this way? Who 
Ooh, that's nice. All right, let's just break through this wall. We're pretty close to where we need to be to get get home. This is should be the back baggage area where we started off, the first place that we went along, and then uh, we can just go right and go out the door and go home. Yep, this is the back room. That's where the dogs were. Yep, let's just head home. I don't know when respawns are going to happen here, so we got to be careful. I did I did throw down my land claim block again, so this area is all claimed for us. So they shouldn't be respawning right here. But better safe than sorry. All right, let's get upstairs. Okay, we're home now. There's the mini bike. All our gear. Now I melted up all the iron we had collected before into the forge. We've got the crucible in here, so now we can start making steel. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff away. We've got to decide what we're doing tomorrow. There's the, the, the uh, concrete that we had picked up today, or the cement, and we made it into concrete, so we've got some more. We have enough to build a small base if we need to. Um, so with that, we're going to really need to check this place out tomorrow. So we're going to go through here tomorrow morning, loot everything that we can, kill any zombies that remain. I want to check these access ways to see what they go where they go to. So we, maybe we do that first, see if there's any zombies left over. Once we've done that, um, I think we're free to contact command. I'll get the generator running tonight, hook it up to the wire uh, system here, and see if we can't get this tower working and get a connection with these uh, with these dishes here to command and find out what's going on. All right? But I'm going to leave it here. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you tomorrow.